again. No, okay, so <laughs> I go I go to meet up with her last night, and like she's like a little bit drunk. She's had a couple drinks. Oh, you met her? Uh, no, this is my second time me, uh, meeting her. Last time I met her was like two months ago. So I just hit her up randomly. You met her on Tinder? Um, I met her on one. I don't remember which one of those I met her on, but yeah. Dude, how do I don't you think get it's good at that Tinder. shit? I don't even spend enough time on that shit, bro. Dude, it's all about copy and paste, bro. I don't message him. Ex- that's why. You're not You can successful. message him? Oh, no, not on Tinder, bro. Yo, there's other ones. Like, th- I think this one's from Plenty of Fish. I'm not sure, though. I think so. But yeah, you can actually message her. Okay. And, um, yo, you should go on that shit, dude. Yo, you can kill it. Yo, there's a lot of Indian chicks, dog. On uh, Plenty of Fish? Yeah. Throwing that you, pussy out you, there? You can pick, like, which ethnicity, which race you what want. What the fuck? And they just pop off, dog. I swear. Bro, That's the best suck. one. And oh, then you just man. copy and it's paste. It's so easy to get laid line. now, man. What? It's so easy to get laid now. It sort of sucks. I know. No work. It was better when it was harder. Yeah. Now, now that's easy, I don't even get laid. It's so I just stop. I just like, I don't even want to do Dude, it. Dude, so she oh tells me this. Okay, okay, so she's had a couple last night, right? She had a couple drinks. She had a couple. couple cocktails. <laughs> <laughs> she had a couple cocktails. And Are you cute? It's funny. Uh, she was drinking a drink that was named after her. Let's name her... Um, Aries. Uh, no, no, no. Let's name her... Tequila Sunrise? No, let's name her... Hold on. Let's give her a nice name. Julie. Okay, Julie. Mint Julep? You said she was naming, uh, drinking a drink that was named after her. Yeah, like she Cold said... Cold 44? Cold 45? No. It was like the uh, the Julie. Because she goes to this bar like kind of often and like they named the drink after her pen. Oh. So like the... Uh, she's drinking the Julie. Maybe she's had a couple... Th- maybe three or four. I don't know. You met her at a bar? No, I met her on Plenty of Fish. I no, think. no, I know, but where'd you go meet oh, her? Oh, at a bar. The first time or yesterday? First time was at her house. Okay. Second time was at her bar. Oh, first time you at the house? Did you? Yeah, get your we're just chilling. No, oh, no, 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 not really, dude. We're just chilling, and she just fell, and she kind of fell asleep. But she, you know, she was a cool person to talk to. You know, oh. she's uh, she's an artist. She like draws. And she, she looks like she an has artist. A bunch of, yeah. So she tells me, I say, she goes, oh, like we will go back to my house and hang out, but like my brother's there, and like he just. Like, he just came here, like, a month ago, and I went out to Mill, and I, like, I got super drunk, and I had a white night stand with a guy, and I brought him back to the house, and I completely forgot that my brother was there, and she's into bondage, she said, so, like, they were doing a bunch of weird, freaky shit upstairs, and, like, they were mad loud, and her brother got super pissed. Like super, <laughs> and now like she's yeah, like, open the, I'm she's like, <laughs> she's like, um, yeah, I can't really have guys over right now, really like that. <laughs> yeah, so yeah. she's like, yeah, let's go to the park and just walk my dog. What? Is it? <laughs> so we went to the park to go walk her dog. Yeah, so at least she was fucking, dude. At least she fucks. At least she fucks. So you're gonna smash that or what? Damn, it must have been dark she, as fuck in the second. She's pretty. She is pretty cute, dude. Yeah. She reminds me of this chick I sort of like. The, I'm not talking to her yet. Because we have business interests together. Can you not? Is fucked up. You think you can hear that in the? Oh, for sure. Should I turn it off? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like shit, doesn't it? Yo, so um, if you put, yo if you WD forty that bitch up, I'm sure it'll be better. Yo, so POF. That's that's the thing, huh? Yo, that's way better than Tinder. I'm telling you, dude. The right Tinder, picture. You know what, what fucks it? What fucks up on my phone? It tells me. Someone likes you. Yeah. Wait. I click on the thing. Yeah, and it doesn't tell me. It doesn't tell me what. So what wait, is that? Okay. So listen, you, I, I can literally <laughs> run your plenty of fish, and I'll literally get you mad dates. I know. Oh. I know how to talk, <laughs> dude. I know how to talk to them on plenty of fish. I swear. Well, let me, let me. Okay, if I decide to fuck with, maybe them. that should be like my job r- right now. Just yeah. Manage yeah, yeah. people's okay. plenty of fish. What's it called? What do they call those people who like match people? You're like a POF, like matchmaker. You're a matchmaker. Yo, this is what I'll say. Let me try it first. Let me try it first. And then if I fucking suck, you're right in there, man. (laughs) I'm throwing you right in the mix. You're throwing me right in the mix, dude. I got you, dog. Ah, man, this chick, I know she wants to fuck. I'm so sure. And she's super cool. Like, I'd probably date her, actually. Mm -hmm. Like, she's really cool. Like, she. Is annoyed about the exact same shit that annoys me when it comes to relationships. No, I'm gonna get my Gatorade. Oh, fuck your, fuck your raid, dog. I'm but um, Gatorade. <laughs> Wait, you remember that? What? what? Uh, Waterboy. 
Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Gatorade. It's too old. Gatorade. <laughs> Water sucks. It really, really sucks. So I don't know, man. You know, chicks are crazy, dude. Dude, I will run your POF profile. I got you, though. No, no, no. Let me roll with it for a while. I, I, I don't like to get laid, just because. I like to get laid, cause I did some shit. Oh really? Sort of. Oh really? I think I think it helps me <laughs> get off. Get laid, just to get laid. <laughs> no, I mean obviously anyone would get laid to just get laid, but I'll just get I your prefer, date, dude. I got if you let me run your shit, I'll get your date. You'll just go. Why can't date. I give myself a shot? I already know how to talk. Because I'm proven already. I know. Oh, fuck you, it's Diggy. Proven already. You are, okay. You are proven, but bro. I get oh my god you killing me dog I get laid no problem no I know <laughs> I know but you gotta hit but you gotta hit it from all angles you gotta You're right. you gotta hit the tinder <laughs> you gotta hit the plenty of fish you know you, what you gotta go to the bad I, I, I used to use Facebook a lot to get laid and it sucks it's the worst it's the worst now yeah no 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 Facebook is is the worst, is the worst because you can't bang a girl that you have any mutual friends with because then she's like oh my god they're gonna know that yes yeah, you know what I mean sure. yeah it's sure. dude fuck that because. Dating sites are specifically for girls that want to get in it. Why yeah. else would you be up there? And then I, I love the girls that are, are like, they put up, looking for a, um, uh, what the fuck is it called? Casual. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> um, like, uh, looking for a sugar daddy. That's what you like. No, no, no. Like, I'm saying, like, it's funny how there's a lot of girls on these yeah, dating sites that. that, like, post, like, oh, I'm just looking for a sugar daddy. I've seen that. Like, take me out to dinner. Like, buy me some clothes. And they'll link to their Amazon wish list. Yeah, And, like, fuck fucking that. morons are going to click on the link and, and buy they do fucking, that. the panties that she likes, the books that's on her wish list. And they are do you that. fucking kidding me? Yeah, for sure. There's so many suckers on there. Do we know some people who have? We have to. What? We have to know people who have. We know too many people. What? Who've that done bo- that. Oh, for sure. Yeah. yeah. For sure. Loki? Loki lonely one? For of them? sure, definitely bought some chick something. Molly. I think so. That one Molly chick, I bet you he did. Hey, she was pretty odd, but jealously is just This is this is exactly the same conversation every time I bring her up. Lonely You always say you always say, Oh hey, she was pretty hot. Yeah, she was. But she didn't get none. Uh-huh. You don't think they even fucked, huh? No. You know that? I don't. But I th- oh I no! Play. I think they did. I think they did actually. Like when, back in the day, but when not she now. was seventeen and he was at the hub. Yeah, when, when he, he had the penthouse at the hub. Dude, I always, you know what? That's that's not the first time I started questioning Loki Z, but that's definitely when I knew that I couldn't hang out with him. That I couldn't just come over when he hit me up because I'd come by and there'd be like loads of seventeen-year-old women. Girls. Why did I say women? 17-year-old girls. And uh, nobody there was even 19 or less. Everyone was in college for a couple of years. Well, yeah. It's, you know. So it's all illegal. It's so fucking weird. Like, rape illegal. So I'd come in, and I'd be like, hey, nice to meet you. And then they'd be, I'd be like, yeah, how do you know these chicks? Oh, they know from back then. Yeah, they school to the high school. I'm like, wait, how old are these chicks? Dude, I fucked up, man. And then I just ran. My first couple weeks at, at the view, I had a chance to bang this really hot girl, dude. And, like, so it, it's funny. So I met hey. this one girl, right? I met this one girl maybe, like, the first week I was in Arizona State. I don't want to say her name. No, 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 no. What was her name? I don't know. We'll call her... Uh, Can you tell me her name later? I yeah. might know her. I don't know. Yeah, her. I don't know. Let's call her Drea. Okay. Drea de Mateo. Ah, uh, damn, she's fine. No, she was super fine, dude. Okay. She was uh, She was super fine. What was her race? Uh, she was a white girl, very, very pretty, and then um, I met her, and then a couple days later, I met a girl who I started dating, and I'm definitely not going to say her name. Okay. No, uh, let's call her Rachel. Let's call her Rachel. Another Rachel. Or another one. Man, yeah, he's Rachel. With the names. <laughs> and, uh, okay, so, I, so in about a week after I met Rachel, I'm having a party at my place, uh-huh. and I invite both Drea and Rachel. Bad move. Right. Bad fucking move, dude. Everybody told me it was a bad move and me being like, oh, I'm going to invite these two hot chicks. Bad fucking Idiot. Guys. Trying to be the fucking man, you know? Right, so right. I invite these two chicks. Like a badass. Rachel and Drea, they fucking come and Rachel's obviously like, like, so pissed. like, she's not pissed, but she, but she's like, where's this bitch? Like, I'm going to like, fuck her up. No, I'm not going to fuck her up, but like, I'm going to hook up with Holy. She, like, you know what I mean? Like, it was like a little t- territory. Yeah. Thing fucking stupid 
So this up. girl, first of all, this girl Drea was super hot, hotter fun. than Rachel. Hotter than Rachel. You fucked up. Yeah. And can you please? I actually ended up dating Rachel for a while, right? For like a year. Bad move on my part, though. Oh, horrible. she's a terrible person. Or are you just fucked up pussy chances? Nah, man. She she was uh, she was a fucking terrible person at that point in her life. <laughs> <laughs> Probably still is. Dude. Yeah. Probably still is. I don't know. Well, uh, uh, why do you feel so guilty? I don't feel guilty. Do you, I don't, dude. Yeah. She definitely probably is, but like I haven't really, dude. And it's funny. She just texted me yesterday. You want to see what, dude? This girl texted. No, no, finish me. the story first. No, so like what I ended up, and I ended up hooking up with Rachel instead of Drea, and then Drea, I guess, saw me hooking up with Rachel, and like she never let hung out. She never let her go, and I never got the chance to bang her. That's happened to me. So hot dude let me see and then this and then this girl was like no and then like rachel was like what's this why why okay so this is the backstory i texted her let me see your name let me see your name too okay 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 so the backstory is so i texted her let's see maybe like a month and a half ago give or take just saying hey what's up you know because like we spoke we, we spoke the, the first time I got to Arizona last yeah. May after yeah. leaving, you know, the initial time. I saw her about a month after I came back here. And, mm-hmm. like, we had dinner, but, you know, a couple things happened and we kind of stopped talking, right? She stopped talking to me yeah. for no, for, like, literally no, no fucking reason. Stupid bitch. Stupid fucking bitch. Yeah. Like, I, and, like, this doesn't happen to me. You know, like, yeah. if I'm, like, I don't have fucking girls just completely stop talking to me because I'm just not the type of guy. I'm not crazy. Yeah, but girls do that now. I'm not fucking, like, I don't get jealous. I only get jealous when, like, there's obviously some, like... Yeah, but girls stop talking, you know, if they just don't want to deal with you. That's just the move. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's the fucking move. If they don't want to talk with you, yeah, even I, they have no problems with you. I know. Like, I'm not talking about So, I texted her about a month and a half ago. I said, you know, hey, what's up? Never get an answer. No, 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 no. I text her, hey, what's up? She answers me, and, she, and she, she's like, hey... And, and I'm like, wow, didn't even expect you to answer. And she's like, well, I didn't expect you to text me. And, okay. then, and then I say, I'm like, oh, really? Ha ha. How are you? Long time no talk. No answer. No answer. No answer for a month and a half. This is Rachel. Rachel. And then yesterday she texts me. Why do you still, why do you want to still talk to me? Question mark. It's a month and a half later. Don't respond to her. What? What a crazy person. Wait, what? This is just what happens. What is she? And then, dude, I should literally take that question and be like, well, I should ask you the same thing. 100%. Like, what? Like, dude, does that even make sense? Because the thing is, she just wants I'm to a pick. pretty lo- I'm a pretty logical guy. Yeah. I can connect the, you know, the logi- the logistics to a situation. Yeah. But you're missing this. Dude. But I'm like missing like what? Like what? That makes sense to me what she did. What? Why? What is she? What did, did she just get like broken up by some guy? Like, did she just break up with some guy that probably cheated on her like forty times? And now she's like, oh, Tony was so nice. I need to text him. Mm, I think that for women and really people, but dudes, especially more normal dudes, they have a way of just like brushing over it and not thinking about it. But when you share time with someone, you like. They, like, take a part of you, and you take a part of them, right? Yeah. So, like, I think for most people, chicks especially, when they're with someone and they leave them, they're always, in their mind, have a part of them that thinks about them. Yeah. You know? Yeah. So... And, of course, she thinks about me. No, of course. That was the nicest guy ever to her. I'm saying, like, she may never want to see you, or maybe she does, but she's just trying to wrap her head... Around why an ex would try to see an ex. Maybe. That could be one explanation. Yeah. Like, what is this? Like, the same reason why I ask all these crazy questions here to all my homies. Because yeah. I'm like, there's really no answer. And even if I completely disagree with your answer, it might help somebody else. But, like, that's just the point. We're all yeah. different. So, I don't know what she wants. But the thing is, like, it's so hard and things like that. Because, like, there's a million reasons why she could say that. She could be feeling weak and lonely. She could be feeling good and strong. There's no way she's feeling good and strong. How do you know? Because I know. I feel like you're projecting. No, okay. I definitely All know. Right. <laughs> I, de- I definitely know. I know what kind of person she is. Okay. Like, dude, because, like, even though she was kind of young when she came to uh, to college, yeah. 
I still got to know her, her yeah. very, very well. Like right. her. Yeah. She's definitely not happy. She's not happy with herself for sure. Even though Cause she's she hot. does, cause she do, she's pretty. She, she, yeah, I mean, she's pretty hot. Yo, do you remember her? I don't know her last name. I have to remember. You All have right. to show, yeah. Yo, you have to. You have to show me who these two are, cause I'm sure I know. Them. Okay, you definitely. Sh- should I show you now? Yeah, yeah. Put a little. Okay, so, um, that's so Rachel thing. blocked. So Rachel blocked me. Yeah. Like what? Blo- she like blocks me and unblocks me like all the time. All the fucking like. like yeah, what that means she thinks doing? about you often. Yeah, because I was a fucking nice guy, and then she gets fucking fucked by all these guys and you and fucking used. Well, that's not what dudes do. A lot of dudes do that. This girl, on the right. On the right, that's the uh, Drea the, chick. That's Drea. Her. Oh, and she wanted you. Yeah. She's pretty cute. She's cute, dude. She's hot. Yeah, and she those is pretty hot. Fake tattoos. They're fake? Yeah, they look fake. Do you, yo, do you know what she told me? She, 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 she's like, oh my god, I love everything. But like, I'm going to make my dad get me fake tits. Fake tits. She literally told me, she's like, I'm going to ask my dad to get me fake tits. A lot of girls do that in America, though. Dude, are you fucking kidding me? The nerve. Dude, I would fucking... A lot of girls do that in America. I would just get a bucket of water and just, I just want to just spill it all over her. Like, okay, are you good now? Are you back to fucking reality? <laughs> are you back to reality, woman? <laughs> hey, like, dude, yo, yo, she's bro, she's pretty hot, man. Oh, she I looks good right she there. Looks, she looks I would good. smash that. Dude, she looks no, good. Her like body 100%. is just like... Why don't we find her and her friend? She probably, she's, she's going probably... out with some toolbox, dude. Whatever. Yeah. What about the other one? What's your, um, what's your let, let's uh, see. Rachel look like? Rachel. So, yeah, totally showed a nice... Oh yeah, uh, she blocked. How old is she? How old is she? How old is she? No, how tall is she? How tall is she? Oh, she's, she's, really she's, she's tall. pretty tall. Yeah, she looks taller than friends. Yeah, and then let me show nice you. Nice brunette. Yeah. Oh, dude, very nice. Very hot. I was stupid, dude. I can't believe I fucked up. Why'd you go with the other one? What was the reason you went with the other one? Because I'm, because f- I'm a fucking idiot. Dude. Were you scared? No. What was the reason? You, is there any way you could break? Because it down your head? no, I don't know. I started hooking up with Rachel, and then like. I was just fucked up. Uh, yeah, I was like, fuck it up, dude. Damn. That's... Was, man. I know, bro. <laughs> There's so many me. things where I fucked oh up when I was younger God, in terms of relationships. I'm so mad at myself after. I can't even tell you. Isn't it weird when you know someone who gets married, like, really young? Yeah. That's Rachel? Yeah. I know her. Yeah. Wait a minute. Yeah. Yo, you want to know something? What? Tell me. Loki Lonely definitely tries to hook up with her. No way. 100%. I've How do you know? I've seen her at the, uh, the old spot a couple times. No, because he's... Um, no. She's friends with... No. He, re- he like, tried Not to- sitting like they're friends, bro. No way. What do you mean they were making out? They're on the island. What? What do you... The Remember at the sofa where he never moved from? He only laid from. It would be right next to the door. You'd walk in. He'd never yeah. move from it. Uh-huh. He'd like ask people to bring him shit. He get the blood tossed to him, like wouldn't even reach out from it or step uh-huh. step a foot off of the island because the water would drown him. Uh-huh. They're on the island together. Yeah. Damn, dude. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say that, but no, that's okay. But dude, like, does Loki only really know? Dude, I wasn't. Dude, I wasn't like friends with him back then. Like he was just like some random dude. Yeah, me too. I don't blame For him. Me too. But I mean, does he know that you're with him? Does he, does he know, know that, that I was with ex? her? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Because I, I never so. knew that. I don't know, but yeah, I would have told you earlier. Yeah, dude, I don't. Dude, I don't what a don't scumbag, know. dog. If he know. knows, because he stayed out there. Fuck, yeah, man. no, because yo, dude, I know that. Dude, no. <laughs> God what? damn it. Uh, go of ahead, course, bro. dude. Go of ahead, course, ahead. I mean, dude, he's a fucking dude. I would, like, what am I gonna? But and dude, the thing is, I literally like back then, I didn't even like talk to him. So that chick is crazy. She's absolutely out of her dome. Why does she act sweet? Because that's her act. In rea- in reality, dude, in reality, she used to leave my spot. Told me she's going home. Like we like we would like, you know what I mean? Like, all right, whatever. She used to like leave my spot at no, night, I- and she's like, okay, we're I'm go I'm going back to my fucking dorm. I'm like, all right, she used to fucking go downstairs, four floors down, and like party with like a bunch of people without telling me, without even without even like being like. Okay, what uh, you can tell him, but dude, like, what the f- who does that? A scumbag. What? And then, holy shit, a, I know this stupid chick. Yeah. I don't like her. I hate her now. Uh, dude, you should hate, I'm telling you. 
I this fucking broad, hate her. She, yo, this girl is like the devil. You don't even know, dude. She sort of She looks used like to, the yo, devil. she literally like. She used to come to my apartment, right? Because I had a nice spot at the view. Okay. Lit, lit at the top floor. Like, I knew a lot no, of people there. The floor. And this broad, like, I used to invite her over. Like, yo, just come. Just come here. I don't bring your friends. Like, yo, just come here by yourself. I don't want to see your fucking dumbass fucking 18-year-old. Oh, bags. It's 41 IQ fucking chicks, okay? Yeah. I don't want to fucking see them. What? Literally, this broad would bring her friends every, every single time. time. And I used to get to, oh. This was one of the worst ones. The Not even one of the worst ones. What the fuck? So there was like, okay, do, do you remember the undie run? Yeah, of course. So there was the undie run, and then after that, oh, they, they like, had like an, okay, so. Undie run, everyone just runs in their underwear and uh, tries to cut the field. And, it's and they donate. I yeah, think they canceled it. They now. donate all their clothes. Yeah. And then you run in your underwear. Yeah, and, and it's a great place to see the hottest bitches in the world because that's what AAC is known for still. But I think they shut it down now because there's too many oglers and people who weren't in school trying to jump yeah. in. Don't go ahead. Wait, hold on. Well, w- which story was I just saying? Um, the chick. Your, your I know, I know. Hold undie on. Run. Oh, yeah, the undie run. So there was this party after the undie run in the apartment complex where I live. Yeah. And View? Yeah. So she was wearing, like, a bra and, like, panties. And, like, at the party we, we were going to, it was a lot of, like, my friends and shit. Yeah. And, like, people I know I'm like yo put on some like shorts like you, I'm not going there with you dressed like a fucking like an 8th street hua <laughs> you're not I'm like I'm not going so all my friends can go fucking look at your fucking your pussy and your ass and shit yeah you know like I'm not stupid put on some fucking shorts and we'll go like is that not fair yeah is that not fair no no, it's fair. It's fair. It's fair. Exactly. exactly. She made a huge deal out of it. Huge. I'm like, dude, like, how do you not understand what I'm saying? Yeah. It'd be like, Yo, you have a camel toe. Yeah. My friends are going to be there. What the fuck is wrong with you? Yeah. And I 100%. Did, yeah. So she finally, bro, after like 30 minutes of like arguing, she finally put some shit, like some short shorts on. Like, like she used to pull like shit. Dude, she used to literally, I once, um, okay, so. I'm not she feeling, leaves my I house. Hate, okay, hate, wait. So she leaves. Oh my god! Wait till you hear the. Wait till you hear this shit. Okay. So, I find, I I found her cell phone. Right? Yeah. Obviously, boom, boom, boom. I'm in. After got typing it. in her, I'm in. I don't. I'm a master. Okay. If I can, if I can dude. The back. Ba- let me tell you how to. If you don't know, if you don't want to. If you don't, okay. If you want to get into someone's iPhone, you wipe, you wipe the screen. You wipe the screen. The screen. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then you ask them, you be like, yo, can you put in your password? Like, you know, if they have a password on their phone, yeah, yeah. you put in the password, right? And be like, oh, I just got to make a phone call or something. So whatever. Yeah. They put the password. So like, and when you hang up, you kind of go toward the light and you can see which yeah, buttons yeah, she yeah, pressed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? 100%. So after like a good like 15 tries, you get I it. got it. Right. Okay. So this was, I think, January or January or February. Right. And I look at her text, for, and I see it's like, oh, it's like her old boyfriend. Damn. And he texted her in, like, January. He He's like, oh, like, you want to know, like, something to the fact that, oh, like, like, I'm afraid, like, you're doing, like, weird stuff with guys out there because, like, you got really good at giving blowjobs. Yeah. This is on, this is, like, on winter break. Yeah. She goes, yeah. He's like, I'm really worried because, cause, like... You give really good head all of a sudden. Yeah. Oh, and I was you. already dating her. Yeah. Dog. I fucking full like I flipped the fuck out, dude. I called her a whole bunch of fucking names and shit. Was it over then or you guys kept dating? No, dude. It was oh, like shit. half over. It was like half over. Oh man. But like I got super fucking pissed and like Dude, I told her some really, like, really fucking fucked up. Not, not fucked up shit, but, like, some shit that a girl needs to hear if she's doing stuff like this. Hell yeah. I'm like, dude, you're gonna fucking go to, you're gonna catch HIV, like, like you know, you're gonna catch some shit, or, you, or you're gonna get pregnant, or, like, you're just gonna end up killing yourself yeah. at some point because you feel so bad about yourself. Holy shit, dude. And, like, dude, she has a very weird relationship, <laughs> with, like, w- like, with her dad. Her dad was, like, in, like... Some like uh, uh, cop position or like someone. Like, you I broke don't know. your rule. You broke your. He rule. was super. He was. What was your rule not made yet? 
what? your rule of always checking for the women, the 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 potential dating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but dude, I was infatuated. Dude. She was like pretty and like she had a nice butt. Yeah. Was She's pretty stupid. and had a nice butt. That's ruined <laughs> so many empires. <laughs> That's taking out so, so many bars. things. Yeah. Helena Troy, Cleopatra, fucking Rachel. Look at John F. Kennedy. Homie got shot. <laughs> Maryland. I mean, not over <laughs> Maryland, but maybe. Hey, you, you never, never know. know. Some, Fuck. some Texas yeah, guy's like, over. Maryland's nice. Yeah. Come <laughs> on. <laughs> <laughs> Hit him with a magic bullet. Hit him with a magic bullet. <laughs> just like a shot in the air and it came down. Yeah. Shot in the air in Louisiana and it came down in Dallas. Yeah, right? Dude, <laughs> no, no joke. Yo. Um, yeah, she's cute. But damn, you should have hit the other drink. I should have hit the other drink. I know. Because you could have at least gone through some problems with someone that's at least one point higher in the 10 scale. Yeah. The, not, How much hotter do you think? Dre is yeah. like an 8.5. And Rachel mm-hmm. is... It was like a seven and a half. With no, a seven. Nice no, seven. Who has a better I butt? Seven. I don't know. Oh, I think, yeah, I gotta show you a picture, man. I think I got a picture of a butt. I think. Let's just show me. But, um, I gotta find it, dude. What, uh, you don't know who has a better butt? Um, I think. I think Dre, bro. I don't, I don't know, dude. I never got to see Dre's butt, really. Yeah, that's true. And clothes it's can so be deceiving. Stupid. Especially now with fucking yoga pants. I know. Butts could look so good, and that shit comes off, and it's just like, comes down with it. Comes down with the pants. You're like, what the fuck? No, dude, dude so, legs? like, I had a crazy, like, relationship with this girl. And, like, dude, she's just like... How long? She it was, like, less than a year. Oh, damn, oh, crazy, like, though. Yeah, it was so far. She pulled so many fucking moves, and then she would blame me. She, like, wrote me a letter for my birthday. The birthday letter, like, oh, bro, I like you, blah, blah, blah. But you just got to trust me more. In your birthday letter. In my birthday letter that I already shredded. You shredded it. I shredded it. I, dude, I shredded it. I was like, are you fucking kidding me? You got to trust me more. I trust you. Are Woman. you trying to give yourself a present? Woman. Like, you... Like, I literally have walked out of the the fucking view, and some guy was like, dude, my friend... Like, we were like, me and Rachel yeah. were arguing. Yeah. Like, well, she's, she, she, you know, she's like walking away. And some guy's like, yo, dude, uh, my boy was just with her last night. What the fuck? I swear. We're like... Oh, I was yeah, yeah, yeah. And then she like... Well, and then she like quickly walked away and then just walked and I, I I just walked up to my room and just like smoked so much pot that night that I just like and you still stuck it around not man. really though but I why, didn't really what was, what was the reason you didn't just quick end it is it cause you're a nice guy or you just didn't no know? I don't know I thought, dude, I th- at first I thought she had a lot of potential and I'm like I just went away. Away, just went away, dude. She's but yo, she was, was like that your first major relationship. Nah, no, no, no. My first major relationship was with this girl in um, New Jersey. Was this your first major shitty relationship? Um, I guess all relationships when no, they end it's have all the shitty, be dude. shitty. It's all bras are nuts, dude. Yeah, most of the time when it ends, it's shitty. If you have a relationship and you know how to fucking break up well, please hit me up. Just. You don't even need to be on the show. Just let me know the secret. Yo, coolest chicks, dude. The coolest chicks I've honestly met. The yeah. girls that can keep a great relationship. Spanish girls. Yeah. Bro, the the, the Dominican chicks. Yeah. Black girls yeah. know how to fucking keep a relationship going. Yeah. They know. They. I don't know what the deal is with these white chicks, but dude, I'm starting to go to the dark side. I don't give a fuck. Nah, I'm, I'm with you. Dude, like these Puerto Rican chicks, like they know. Like, you know because it, they know in those countries they know how to keep a relationship a lot in those countries, countries and, and they keep those traditions there a lot the males are the alphas and the women support the males over here the and it's you know it's just a different culture like if you go as a male there like I was reading into it and just like here and like I got plenty of homies that live in Colombia and shit mm-hmm. and I was like reading some shit on Chile and Argentina like this dude he was there he's eating uh, a meal with a whole bunch of couples and then he got up to help the women after they're done with the dishes, and they sat him the fuck down. The women. The dude's like, "You don't need to do that." And he's like, "No, I'm going to." And they just sort of gave him like, "Go ahead." And the women are like, "No." That's what I'm saying. You you sit. That's the men what I'm sit. Saying. Indian we girls. No. Yeah. What's up with these white girls? I think it's because we're foreign, dude. We're not American. <laughs> See, maybe white dudes and white girls, they get it. If you're completely Americanized and you don't have, like, too many foreign traits, maybe you get it. Because I'm going to tell you this. The chick that I'm, like, debating, like, breaking my rule and sort of seeing what's up with her, she looks white, 
but she's Mexican. Really? Yeah. I love Mexican chicks. And it's just like... <sighs> bro, so do you know... Like, I think, whenever I, think I get right, mad dude. at a chick, dude, I swear, dude, this is actually really funny. Do you tell them... Do you, I wish you were black! Do you know what plays <laughs> back into my head, dude? What? That Dave Chappelle, Wayne Brady episode where he says, Does bitch? Wayne Brady have to slap choke a bitch? Does Wayne Brady have, have to, to choke, choke a bitch? bitch? I swear to God, that plays back in my head. Every time, like, something like that happens... That's actually... I just think in my head like this. I think it's something. I think it's something similar when you I think of I mean? any time of going into a relationship. Oh, God, <laughs> now when right. that happens, I'm like, something bad will happen. Do I want to go into this potential? Dude, you gotta somebody? date these Mexican <laughs> Latin girls, these Dominican chicks, dude. I know. Puerto Rican girls too. I know. Cam, Cam you, you gotta give them a lot of attention, but. Cameron's wife, I think, is Dominican. They know what's up. Dude, they, they know, know what's, what's up. up dude. They, they have their own personality. They'll say what they need to say, but they got your back. Yeah, and the Dominican chicks are actually cool enough girls to bring around hot chicks for their man's friends. A which lot of white girls I don't need. Do yeah, I know. White girls, they're white so girls subconscious. They, they're like, they always I'm have, not going to bring a, a chick that's hotter than me. Yeah, Mara. they always have uglier Always uglier have. Friends. Dude, if an, okay, if a hot chick has only ugly and, fa- and fat friends, she's run a piece for of the shit. fucking she's run a piece of shit. for the hill. She's dude. a vain piece of shit. She's a fu- If yeah, a hot she, chick has nothing but hot friends, She's cool as fuck. She's cool as fuck. Because she has she knows no deal. qualms. No, yeah, She's exactly. not worried about that little game shit or other girls. Yeah, she's she's not... just there because she believes in herself. That itself is a turn on right there and attractive. And it puts you on like the 5% of all chicks who are like that. But also, it means that if I have another friend who's a girl, I don't even need to worry about you worrying. I don't, I don't need to worry about you fucking tripping on me just hanging out with them. You know what I'm saying? Dude, my, lo- my leg looks super muscly from here. Sorry. You wish. Look, look, look at that. Today was leg day for me, dude. I can yeah? barely pick up my legs. No way. No, no, I forgot to stretch after. I was in a rush. And my legs feel okay, but I'm a little sore. So, but, so, man. So, now you were talking shit about the Warriors, right? And then you're talking about how the Clips are going to just handle them no problem. Yeah. Do you think they're going to do it with both of the point guards out? That's going to be an interesting I don't think they have a fucking shot. I don't think think they've got a chance, dude. Dude, because I was like, Golden State has a pretty good chance of taking out the Clippers without without, uh, Steph. But without Chris Paul, they are Does that mean Jamal Crawford's about to run point? They're going to try to run Austin Rivers a point of bed and keep Jay Croft off the bench. Because they need someone who can yeah. instantly put up points when all their starters are sitting. Literally, you have five starters. Yeah. They start, then they sit, and then Jamal Crawford handles the rest. Yeah. And then they slowly yeah, bring so them Austin in. Rivers, Jamal Crawford at the two. Hey, man, it's, it's going to be a tough series, bro. Dude, are they going to win this series? They're two and two. Damian Lillard is going to start acting up. Damian Lillard is going to be a problem. A problem. So not, wait, um, who's playing tonight, you know? I don't. Okay, well, either way, bro. <laughs> I'm going to fucking watch it. The Celtics playing? Tomorrow. That's 2-2, two and two, right? That series is 2-2, two two, right? 2 two. Man. This, that, the I fucking know. Clippers Portland and the Atlanta Celtics, the two series I thought were going to be the Atlanta best. Atlanta Celtics best. are the best. So the Spurs and Cavs are already sitting. Yeah. Spurs, Cavs. Oh, bro, they... They always sit. <laughs> First round, sweeps. Whatever, <laughs> fuck them pegs. Um, bro, I know you want it. I think Loki knows. What? I think Loki knows that that used to be your chick. Because he's the type that keeps his of ear course. to the ground on that type of shit. Of course. What do you mean? And he stays on Facebook. Like he would notice of things course. like pictures and shit. Yeah. Of course. I'm like. Like, like this is a different type of disappointment and anger I'm feeling now. I'm like, this is exactly what I knew would happen, but I'm just like, because dude, it so already happened and I friend, didn't even notice. Okay, do you know her blonde friend? The I don't know the. Ho- oh yeah, the blondie girl. So yeah, who she, does, who she did was a lot supposed of drugs. to yeah she was supposed to live with low key at yeah. the hub, but yeah. then she gave away the fucking lease to. Uh yeah yeah, yeah. Say Urkel fucking name. Urkel Clip already said his Whatever. name a million times Whatever yeah but Urkel hey, AKA So he um... <laughs> Go ahead <laughs> No but yeah so like I guess I don't know I would imagine these Oh no dude I think Cause I think she lived at the At, at the same building She lived in the same building At the hub? Yeah I think Yeah As a low key? Yeah Makes sense 
Loki By the way, Loki's fucking dude. Funny. He would, dude. He would, he he would fuck a shoe if it had a hole in it, dude. Yeah, shit, bro. And he wouldn't care if you he told him not to. He, he wouldn't give no fucks. Of course not. I mean, bro, he's German. He's German. What's that mean about shoe fucking? <laughs> What's that have to do with shoe? You, you, I'm you saying fuck, fuck the shit out would, of a Nike. Yeah, he think, bro. He thinks Germany is the best of everything. Loves Germany, you know. It's, it's we it's probably lose shit. all of our German fans. I realize. No, 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 no. No, no, no. no, no he, he loves. Dude, so he always makes comments about how much he loves Germany. And then the best part was when me and uh, me and Cliff were like, tr- like just trolling him, we're like, oh, <laughs> you know, he, you got to give the Jews back all their fucking gold that you <laughs> stole and melted down. And then that's in the IMF right now in the fucking and, storage vault. And then that fuck. And he, then he was like, "Oh, it's already, it's already been like." Yeah. I'm like, yeah, 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 bro. You're not. First of all, you're an American. That nigga knows nothing about German. That homie can't even speak German. I keep telling him, I'm like, dude, you're not even German. You can't even speak German. He's like, oh, I can speak German. He says some fucking. I'm words. like, bro, you know, like one sentence that you fucking learn online. You don't know if you if you can't read, speak, write German to the level of a German three year old. Then you can't speak game. German. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, hundred percent. There's a five year old German kid that speaks the better fucking German than anybody. Yeah. yeah, you need to at least be able to speak. No, because speech. yo, that's the thing. That's to it. him, it's like a dude. It's like a cult thing. Because okay, he's into football and shit, and football's like a like a cult to him. Yeah. Literally, if we say something he's bad about politics, politics cult, are very dude, culty. Like if you tell him something about how people's heads get injured a lot in football, dude, he'll just dismiss that yeah. idea. Hundred percent. Oh my god! It's like, and then, the but thing. then he'll bring up like how other other sports all have. He's like issues. soccer play. Soccer yeah. is worse for you than football. Yeah. Like, and I was like, oh, I was like, you retarded. I I told him that soccer play. I told him as a result, <laughs> in defense of my argument that football players do get head trauma, is that soccer players get head trauma even from the light hits, long term. Mm-hmm. But I'm like. That doesn't mean that it's more. He just twists it in a way to make you feel good or mm-hmm. to make himself feel good against you. But in all honesty, like, yo, if you want to play football, go play. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But you need to know that there's a chance of severe head trauma. Severe. Severe. Off of one hit. There's a lot of players now who are fucking one year and done in the league. And yeah, a lot of people call them pussies and shit or whatever, have some sort of judgment, especially if it's on their team. But it's like, yo. Mm-hmm. These fools are obviously feeling the effects or some shit, and it's not like they've only played one year of their life. They've been playing for at least like a lot of times four to fucking eight years mm-hmm. to fucking get to that level, mm-hmm. taking hits constantly, especially if they're defensive or lineman players. Mm-hmm. So it's just like, dude, read the fuck lax. Yeah, you know mm-hmm. what's wrong, dude? You hypnotized? No, I'm trying. Like, dude, my vision is so bad. I'm trying to read what time. 38 minutes. Oh, my God. I can't. Why is my vision so bad, dude? I don't know, dude. I can't see. It was it. like blocking out your hearing. You're trying to see. You're like, <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, shit. Um, oh, a lot of missed calls. Look at you, Mr. Popular. Um, Yo, oh, so... Um, what the hell? Yo, um, so fuck Rachel. Yo, fuck and Rachel. Fuck because she's not even available now. I know. No, but dude, yo, someone shared that Rachel used to pull. Dude, I, that, that's not even like, there's like more shit. There's probably, yeah. There's yeah. so much more shit, dude. Like, it was like something, and the thing is, she just obviously used me for where I lived and like the people I knew. Because all, all her friends, yeah. I introduced her to them. Literally. Like, Nicole, like, and I, like all them. bro. Literally, I introduced her to everybody. Everyone. I was the yeah, because you know, like, that's what I fucking did. Fucking bitch. So did she? What was her major in college? Did she graduate now? She should be. Yeah, I think she's graduating now. What's her major? Uh, what was her major? I don't know. Uh, Doesn't matter. Did she something come? dumb? What? Yeah, something dumb. Let's say communications, yeah. whatever. Sorry, communications majors, we love you, but she's dumb. So whatever she could be was like fucking. Organic chemistry is dumb. Yeah. Um, do you think she came to college mostly to just be fucked and have the college yeah, life? Yeah, for sure. Do you think most people come to college now just to be fucked and have the college life? Yeah, 98% of people. Yeah. Probably, yeah. yeah. Even me too. 
I mean, I came for the grades a little bit, but I mostly still came. If my daughter was like, Dad, I want to go to Arizona State University. Ha <laughs> ha. You're going to community college, okay? And then you're getting straight A's, and then you're going to try to get a scholarship. And then, next and then we can talk. And then we can fucking talk about you going to fucking Arizona State. Yeah, yeah, 100%. But other than that, it's not happening. I mean, unless it's residential. Unless you're some, like, mega genius that gets, like, a full ride. I got a full ride. Yeah. My fucking shit was free, dog. They paid me. They paid me a thousand dollars every semester on top of my free ride. Mm-hmm. That's nice. Yeah, so it was the best scholarship they had, the presidential. Mm-hmm. And I still came to party. Party? Because I didn't want to go there, but I had to go um, there to help my fam. So I stuck around and... Uh, dude, I love ASU. I know. This is amazing. No, dude. You really gonna hold that from your kids just because you don't want them to party? Yeah, dude, your kids are gonna my get. My kids fucked. are gonna get they're a gonna scholarship have, to gonna Harvard, have Columbia. Your kids are gonna have terrible debaucherous sex no, while they're going my, to Harvard. My kids are gonna get a scholarship. I'm gonna fucking. So what? I'm I had scholarship. I had sex. No, 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 no. For like, I want them to go to like, I want my daughter to go to Ivy League school. I'm like, I'm gonna. Dude, fuck I should have gone. I could have gone. You, you should have. I only stayed for dude, my family. Am is my lip bleeding right now? Like, I don't Probably. No. No. The fuck. Super, super right. Yo, do, do you have another rap by any chance? No. Yeah. We'll get one later. We'll get one later. Yeah, I'm done. I, um. Rapsky. I, uh. Yeah, I don't know, man. Yeah, Scho- dude. Like, college doesn't. College. <laughs> college. <laughs> college doesn't pay you that much, man. Yeah, it doesn't do doesn't. shit for you, really. All it does is gets you, um, into relationships with bitches who wanna have. who wanna fuck other dudes. Oh, dude, don't even remind me. <laughs> so <laughs> fucking bad. Dude, <coughs> hold on. Yo, what else did this girl Rachel try to Like, now that I'm going back in my head, I'm like, shit. What else did she try to No, nah, we can leave oh, it. Oh, dude, one yeah, time yeah. she accused me. Okay, you, how I first found out that she was really, like, kind of fucking nuts. Yeah. So, well, not really nuts, but, like, I don't know, something wrong with her. Yeah. Nuts, so, nuts. her friend... I mean, I guess it's a little bit weird. Her friend slept in my bed with me because, okay, so this girl, she was like drunk and she was in my apartment partying with like, you know, people Mm -hmm. and I'm and like, she's like, holy, like I need to like pass out somewhere. Like I, like I don't feel well. I'm like, all right, yeah, just go to my room, pass out because I'm a normal person. You know what I mean? I'm a normal fucking guy. Yeah. I'm a nice guy. Yeah, sure. Go pass out of my bed. No problem. Like three hours later, like I'm I'm stumbling around. You know, I'm also kind of drunk. Yeah. Lay down on my bed. Next to her, she's sleeping. Yeah. Fucking wake up in the morning. Everything's right. Like, yeah, I'm going to leave. You know, go to class, come back. Get a phone call from Rachel. She goes, (laughs) I'm like, hello, hello, hello darling. Good morning. Hey, babe. Good morning, sweetheart. Hey, babe. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> you know, what did you do? You expect me to believe that you're in blah, blah, blah with blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> <Y'all can't>... <laughs> really? <laughs> like, you think that's what happened? <laughs> really? She just wanted to get mad for no so, reason. No, Who told she her? She was... Oh. Her friend probably told her. Her friend told her, and then, like, her friend told some, like, it, like, went around their little group, and, like, <laughs> everybody knew that she slept in my bed. <laughs> everybody. And then, like... <laughs> and then the I was social shot. pressure. Was like mad social. She probably yelled at you in front of people. I was like, <laughs> yo, I literally said, woman, you are fucking <laughs> out of your mind. Oh, shit. Yeah, and her friend had a re- really nice butt. I'm not gonna forget that. Her friend had a mad nice butt. Better than Rachel's? I should have banged. What was her head. name? What was her name? Was her name? <coughs> um, I don't want to say, dude. Give her a real name. It doesn't matter at this point. Rachel, like, I they're not gonna. I don't know, dude. But either dude, way, who was it? Who was it? Do I know this chick? I want to. I want to know what butt it is. I want to know if I felt that butt. <laughs> Sarah. No, I don't remember. Okay, well, either way, so yeah, like, she blamed, like, she said me and her had sex, and I, then in my head, like, after, like, maybe, like, a week or two, I was like, yo, I think she's projecting with what she's doing onto me. Uh, Because if you believe, because I was like, yo, because if, 
I mean, if she's going out with me, dating me, I mean, she she has to trust me. Like, yeah, she has she has to tr- like trust me. And like now, yeah, it seems a little weird, but like, do you actually think that I would do that? Not a good call, brother man. If I, I were to you're... bang somebody, it wouldn't be one of your best friends. Hundred percent. Because I'm not a fucking idiot. If I, if I were to bang somebody and I wouldn't cheat, I wouldn't bang anybody. Just yeah. And FYI to all the fucking listeners, if I would, yeah. It would be some random because there's, there's like 40,000 girls here. You think I would pick the one girl that's best friends with my fucking girlfriend to fuck? Exactly. I mean, but you know, the dick wants what it wants at night. Yeah. I mean, she's there. I should have, though. Asha! <laughs> Asha! Oh, I just gotta stand up for a second. My back's like a little bit. Oh, you bitch, you bitch. Oh, well, goddamn. Oh. Um. Mm. Yo, you gotta be out. Nah, nah, I'm cool for now. I'm cool, bro. We got we got recording to do. This is the number one fucking thing to do. Period, man. Oh, Bring it to the people. The people who, who we can't even release this shit to because damn iTunes is chilling. iTunes, we love you. Get us on, baby. We on Stitcher. We on SoundCloud. What is Stitcher? Dude? I don't even it's know. It's it's like another. Look, look. Yeah, I'm gonna show you. Stitcher. Let me show you this. I'm going to show you this. It's about to be monumental, peeps. I'm about to pull us up on Stitcher to show Tolly that we actually exist somewhere. You know how many looks we got in the last uh, couple of days without no. any advertising? How many? 20. No way. It's not that bad. 20 different cats? 20 nice. different cats, man. But, I mean, well. I'm, there's literally nothing being pushed because, you know, I don't have extra shit. Oh, shit. What? Oh. The fuck? Let's see. What is this? The... The third episode. Mm-hmm. Lots of weird shit like normal, which I guess is an oxymoronic statement in itself. Are names even important? Is God important? Rape jokes? Are they ever appropriate? Uh. Let's find out. Thanks again to Chidas for being open and providing his bedroom as our temporary studio. New Cam 2. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? That doesn't even sound how like many, me. Wait, how many listens you said? Um, it was like 20 or some no, shit. Nothing too big, man. It's probably... Yo, yo, dude, 20 is not bad? Getting it lit, man. I just need iTunes okay, so it'll be a lot more. A lot, a lot more. A lot, a lot more. Do, do, do. Oh, man, I forgot to text Matthew. Fuck! Dude, what, what are, are you, you doing? What are you mad about? What am I doing? I forgot, because I was... Doesn't he always forget to hit you up? No, I just... Dude, it's like we literally just play, like, phone tag with each other. Like, it's kind of annoying. Why? He hits you, you hit Yeah, then he falls asleep, or like, I fall asleep, and then, I, and then I miss his call, I forgot to text him. Like, How old are you guys? You falling asleep midday like this. What's going on with you? You guys do heroin? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just asking. You laugh like it's out of crazy, but I'm like, oh. you guys are consistently taking so many day naps that you can't meet with each other as business partners. Like, I'm just trying to wrap my head around it. I'm happy that I never sleep so I can work around your naps. Yo, you're a wild man. I don't know how you (laughs) fuck. I saw your snaps today, by the way. Oh, yeah. What was I snapping? Snapper or something. Cameron at some point. I was snapping a little Cam. Cam! Everyone hates him. Why? Who? No one even knows who he is no more. Yeah, it's because, bro, no marketing. I mean... I mean, he Marcus. No, but like, he Marcus. He ain't certain it, people. He ain't keeping it that high. Yeah, I mean, dude, marketing money is a lot. You know how much money you need to... He's like, doing you know? more shit, man. He got a couple movie deals on Netflix still. He even been on that Larry Wilmore show or whatever the fuck that is. I don't even know. Don't quote me on that name. It could be Larry something else. Larry Wilmore was the executive producer for the Bernie Mac show. Damn, Larry Wilmore. You met the guy, or how do you how do you no. remember that shit? Because I love the Bernie Mac show. So you just I always remember the his credits. Name. I Larry always his Wilmore. name, executive producer. And then you pulled it from your memory. That's pretty good recall, dude. Yeah, dude, I recall. love, dude, I love, dude. The Bernie Mac show is one of my favorite shows of all time. Yeah, love, dude. The Bernie Mac show is amazing, and it's cool it, because he, it correlates with his life completely because it's the same story. Yeah. Like, his sister's, like, a drug addict that goes to jail, and he has to take care of these kids. And in real life, that's exactly what happened. Yeah. And, like, his style of parenting is funny, dude. Like, he beats him down. He doesn't beat him down, but he's, like, rough. He's, like, he tries to be rough. He tries to scare him. You better listen. (laughs) Yeah. You you better listen. Burn Mac. (laughs) I'm Burn Mac. (laughs) Yo. Is you probably the only person in the world where Bernie Mac is your favorite actor in Ocean's Eleven? <laughs> My favorite. I love Bernie. Every, dude, Mr. 3000, amazing. 
Sold that's when he's a baseball dude, right? Baseball player. 3,000 hits. 3,000 hits. Is that? that and then right. Solman, it's him and uh, Samuel L. Jackson. Then what it, the it fuck was his is last that about? Movie. It was his last movie. The oh, fuck? my mother, dude. Dude. I might have to pick up my mom. No. I, I might have to. Boy, ladies and gentlemen. But it's my mom. Da mamulka. I'm sorry. Oh, my God. No, you have everything normal, mamulka. I'm about to kick you the fuck out right now. Ладно, мамулька, я тебе смогу перезвонить. Я тебе перезвоню, обещаю. Давай, мамулька. Sorry. Oh my god, thank no, you. No, dude, I just always have to... If it's my mom, my grandma, or my dad, or my brother, I always have to pick up. Just in case. Holy shit. You're the worst ever. I, I know, guess. dude. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have you to gotta pick up. I have to. Oh my god, you know what we need to do, bro? Okay, I'm going to redo this shit. There's going to be like a poster back there. Look what? Look at this bandy. What happened, dude? Dude, I don't know. I had like a pimple here. I squeezed the f- everything you can possibly squeeze out of it. Disgusting. It's awesome. Belly button bandaid. The belly button bandaid. Yeah, that'll pull a neosporin. Yeah, I'm you gonna know? redo the spot after you apply your neosporin. Oh yeah, what do you mean? Now. You're gonna? No, I'm probably gonna get a poster here. You know, with the with Arch- the stuff. Architectural genius. Yeah. Right. No, no, no. I mean, I'm gonna redo the shit. I'm gonna put a fucking poster here, well, uh, and what? then once that's there, once we make it more official, we're throwing our fucking phones in a box or some shit. Doing this, yo. Show. But what if my mom calls? You get to you got to pre-call your mom and be like for an hour and a half. Oh, I'm off the man. air. I'm right. off the line, mom. I just yeah, all right. But yo, but if it's my dad, I gotta be. No, you tell him to. Oh, it's rough. Dude. I'm on a project for an hour and a half, pops. Well, dude, you have something. Important. The guy's halfway around the world. Like, I no, gotta, you just let him know. I gotta, I gotta. It do doesn't it. take more than ten but seconds. But he, he's not it. gonna call me during the show because the time difference is usually kind of so crazy. I got you, got you. So like, chances are he won't. Call. But if he does, it means it's something very important, and I have to pick it up. I have to. There's well, no then way. we're not pausing the show for you. You're gonna have to stand out in the hundred degree heat. Oh, sure. <laughs> oh, <sure. laughs> you, oh. you probably pick up and be like. Sorry, Dad. Sorry, Pops. <laughs> it's 120 oh, dude, it's outside. about to be hot. Dude, this is probably one of the last cool days. Did you see that gust of wind or whatever the Yesterday? fuck it was? It was just coming like 30 mile an hour wind. It was Shoot. cold as fuck. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was insane. It's cold as shit. Now? Or, or, or like right after? Yesterday, that. dude. Yesterday, during the same time today, it was 96, 99 degrees. It's 78 now. It's nice. It's 78 right now, right now. It's nice. Oh. Yeah. Very nice. It's almost like we're in a dry Cali. Drally. I can't wait to order some pizza when I get home. Pizza? That's your plan. I'm going to order my crunchy thin crust. Mm. Domino's with white garlic sauce, chicken, and onions. You remember that shit we just pulled? Kill them. We just pulled that barbecue sauce switcher. That pizza was disgusting. Disgusting. But, but the second order? one was good. Yeah, well, I didn't even try the second one. Exactly. Oh, so you, you ordered the shitty one for us, and then got a free one for you guys to finish. I see. Did you, did you try the lava cake? I ate one whole I didn't. Yeah, I asked you if you wanted it. I kept asking <laughs> you, and you said, and you said, no. And the other guy said, no. And me and, me and Cliff looked at each other, and cheers the lava cakes. His, <laughs> his blew up in his hand, <laughs> and he burned himself. And I just... <laughs> oh my god, I remember it. I just laughed to it. Ah! I did it to it and it wasn't even hot for me. He's like, oh. yeah. Dude, he was burning and for me, night, it was still the same temperature, but for me it was nothing. I was like, whatever. Last night, he like woke <laughs> up and he goes to the fridge. He like, and he finishes his burrito and he puts mad red sauce on it. Oh. And like all, Lord. and all I hear is, it's so hot. <laughs> like, that's all I hear like in the background. He's like, Ooh, that's that spicy. Yo, do you think we should get Cliff on a, a regiment? Like a workout regiment? Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm i seriously I scared. Him. I'm serious. Dude. 270? 280 now? You is think? he? Wait, is he? I look at him and I couldn't guess less. I was trying to guess that yesterday. I'm 210. Okay. Okay. And I think I'm me, fat. me, me too. I feel fat. I feel so fat. I feel fat. <laughs> I'm like working out to so try to get less fat. fat. And I'm fat. I know I'm sort of fat, right? But I'm Joe Hilfa. Bro, I really think when we look at Clip, like you and me could sort of fit in him. Yeah, maybe. Yo, and and obviously you know, he's not 400 Do you pounds. know where that? Do, do, do you know that, that was all from depression? Yeah, you said, we already talked yeah. about this once. Yeah. But I'm just saying, like, dude, now he's doing good. Let me okay, tell you something. This, 
he thought he got hacked. Yesterday? No. So, wait, like recently? A couple, no, like about a, a, about a year ago. Okay. He wasn't as big. And like something happened in his company and he, and he thought his phone and all his emails got hacked. Mm-hmm. Like shit was acting super weird, you know? Mm-hmm. And like he like freaked out, dude. He thought someone from his... He thought somebody like that he knew hacked the shit. Mm-hmm. For what reason? Um, I don't know. Like he, but like so it why was would mad he gain so much weight though? Because he had like a falling out with his company, and like no, he was I mean super you explained to that. So he just ate and just didn't move, or what? Yeah, he was flipping out, dude. Because they thought that he somebody hacked his cell phone, and like he had a bunch of personal shit in his emails. You know what I mean? He would, you know, his job emails got everything was hacked. Did he get hacked? You said he thought he got hacked. I mean, it's it not a hundred percent, but like okay. it's pretty much like ninety nine percent. Oh, so he got that. It, his shit got hacked completely. His emails, everything. Why was he such a target, dude? I don't know, bro. Because he's I don't know. He's the man, I guess. Okay, so question then. Here's a question. Yeah. Everything switched up and is different now in his life. Yeah. Watch out! I'm sorry. What? Fucking doing calisthenics over here, I'm right like, by the dude, fucking I gotta mic stretch, and shit. Dog. Okay, I get it. The knees. I get it. I get it. But yo, things are going better for him now. He's making change, right? Yeah. Things are going good. But there's one major hole in his life that I can just see. I don't know clip like ten well. I don't know his yeah. female situation, family situation. That's not my business. Yeah. But from what I can see, everything's super good. But there's one factor that could stop that any time because there's no, like, t- it's too early to die of a heart attack age. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So, should he do something about it? <laughs> he should said, someone bring it up once he's gonna, I bring it up to him, yo, once he moves out, he's gonna, it's gonna be all better. Why? So what, it's what he said, because, I don't know, living with roommates and shit, I don't know, like, once he moves out, gets a place of his own, I th- he said he's gonna, like, go to this gym, all, all, all this shit, dude. I'm gonna, like, encourage him, though, a lot. You, I'm you gonna should. keep pushing him, I'm gonna keep pushing him, yeah. I'm gonna keep pushing cause him. because when you're by yourself, easiest time to gain weight. Yo. Because when you're with other people. He, he needs a nice lady in his life to be like, hey, man. That been, but that might not like, happen. with every pound you lose, I'm gonna suck your cock. But that might and not he's literally happen. like the like the first day back from the gym. He's like twelve pounds lighter. He's big. He's, going, he's that big. He is that big that he probably will lose five pounds this first time. Yeah. And if he switches one meal to a salad, he probably lose a hundred pounds. Dude, if he just drinks water. Do you think he's over three hundred? I don't know. I think he might be close. I don't know, but I'm glad. He could be I'm easy glad to do ten. I want, <laughs> I want to be like one ninety. Dude, am I fat? Honestly. No, dude. Am I fat? No. <laughs> No. Am I fat? Yo, is, is Loki lonely fat? He is sort of fat. He's getting fatter. He's getting fatter. Yeah, all that fucking like, pasta, all that laying down, all the milk, all the fucking cereal, all his, all his, all his uh, coffin poses practicing <laughs> on his island, mm-hmm. and Paulina rubbing his hair. Mm-hmm. Yo, Paulina is a chump, man. How can she be with that? I feel bad, oh, bro. Because. Bro, she's like 20 years old. Yeah. She's a junior. Young chicks are... Wait, is she an actual Jew? Junior. Oh, sorry. That's okay. <laughs> I thought you she's said an actual she was Jew- Jewish. No, she's Jewish. And I was like, she's with him? Holy shit, this is crazy. No, dude. No, she's Polish. Yeah. Not a Polish Jew. Dude, she's a so Polish funny. junior. Yo, I was telling him, like, he like we were talking about World War Two. Yeah. And, he, and like, I, like, I was saying, I'm like, listen, the Germans had no chance... The Germans had no chance when they went into Russia, right? I was like, Look. yeah, definitely. Especially I was like, they I was like, listen, once they went in the winter, they were fucked. The winter, yes, but dude, the, so Russians had better tanks, and a lot of people would say the Russians don't have better tanks, you know, better weapons and whatnot. But dude, Russians could put out a tank a million, like way faster than Germany could. Russians had more factories and shit putting out more. Like, the Russians oh, just had way more you tanks. You had weaker tanks but you had more tanks. We I had remember. Ma- not, like, not even weaker, but like... The, they had the best of best tanks, though. Their tanks would chump on ours. Who? I thought the Germans had the best tanks in the Germans had... It depends, The Panzer, though, right? Because, like, they were, like, mad expensive. It took them a yeah, long took time for them to make it. 
Yeah, Russians could make like these five, fucking tanks. I think you had like five tanks for every one of those just fuck their shit up. I remember. Boom, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And then he was it's like... Something. You had a better tank strategy. And then, dude, I actually think America was in cahoots with Germany. Nah. They were, Look okay, at, okay. Look at who is providing all the oil to Germany. Because to fight a world war, you need massive amounts of oil. Germany doesn't have any oil. They don't live on oil. They, yeah. There was no oil there. Yeah. And if you look up, actually, in the history yeah. books and shit, American oil companies all provided oil to the Germans mm-hmm. during mm-hmm. World War Two. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think they're. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know if they knew that they had concentration camps and they were killing all, all the Jews. I don't know that. No, I don't remember, think they, yeah. remember IBM machines were in every concentration camp. Yeah. Um, it's the way that they cataloged the prisoners. Mm-hmm. And um, they had to have, not only were they shipped directly to the concentration camps, but they had to have an IBM operator from the company come to every location once a month yeah. to calibrate the machine. Yeah. So there's Americans in these facilities yeah. fixing the shit. But exactly. this is what I'm saying, like... Mm. America is, in some sense, like Switzerland plus. Like, we have the banks, too. Yeah. And we're willing to sign all sorts of stuff. And if you want to keep your offshore money with us, we'll probably be able to hold that for you. Mm -hmm. Like, that's like the low-key secrets. If you're high enough in your country and you want to make some backdoor deals with us, just hit the CIA up. Just hit the CIA I think El Chapo. Uh, stayed, uh, you know, up top in fucking Mexico. All these fucking. Oh my God. How's anyone in Mexico? Bill, you, know what I mean? you give money to bankers. HSBC yeah. Bank already got fined for. Uh, I think, if I'm not mistaken, it's four billion dollars for like hiding money for them. for hiding cartel money. Proven. Yeah, yeah. Proven. They find nobody went to jail. No, okay. this nobody. Is fine. It's fine. If it four was billion us, dollars. If it was us, we'd do four billion years in jail. We would literally get raped in jail by like monkeys. Fuck, we go to monkey jail. Like we, we would literally go to, like go to zoo jail. jail. We're, we're, yeah, where the bad go. animals go. No, and we're fucked. Joke. Yeah, no weapons. Bro, like, we're fighting. We're fighting. Like murdering in reality, lawyers, yeah. assaulting giraffes, and raping flamingos. Sorry, mm-hmm. I just went crazy. On language. <laughs> what and raping flamingos. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. I just no. Like, think about it. How it. and how long can they make four billion dollars if you're a cartel? You probably make that in like oh, like, print it. They oh. probably have money printers, bro. What do you mean? Dude, I, I hear North Korea prints US, U, U, US money like this. Panama prints US money yeah. like this. Yeah. They have, they have really good fakes now because... Yeah. Uh, really? China, I bet, prints fucking US dollars. Yeah, but, but they have um, different ways to sort of check yeah. them now. They have fakes that are but really... But who's going really to check outside. like a $20 bill? Like if you give like a dude a $20 bill, you think they're going to check if it's real or not? Exactly. No. You can live off fake money your entire life. Oh, 100%. I think they sell they sell bills on the street. Yeah. Like if you you could go buy like fake bills like fifty cents or less on the dollar, depending on how many you get. Yeah. And you just get a bunch of them. Like yeah, give me um, a million fake dollars and I'll mm-hmm. give you a hundred thousand real ones. Mm-hmm. And boom. Sh- and um, now you just need to spend it and never put it in a bank mm-hmm. because to the feel and to any marker test they'll check. Yeah, like, just think about it, bro. They can print all this fucking money. It's yeah. just crazy. Just keep printing money. That's what they do? All day, huh? Uh, do they stop? Day. Ever? They, it, they, 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 it's, there's some sort of balance where they take recirculated shit money out, too. At the, at the, do at they? Rate. But, yeah, I think there's more that goes in than goes out. Like why if there's more that goes out than goes in... Our money would become more valuable. Like, why do they keep making pennies? Dude, you know pennies cost more to make than they are actually worth. No way. Really? They're, they're worth more in copper now than that cent. No way. Yeah. It's just so you can melt it down and yeah. sell it as copper. And what, even yeah. though it's highly illegal to do that. Yeah, it's highly illegal to do that. But whatever it's made out of, it's worth more than the cent. So it's not even worth making them. So why do they keep making them? Because they, no, they got nothing better than I don't them. think they actually make coins anymore, to be honest. Or they make too many, or they just recirculate and melt them down or some shit. I don't think they add coins, but they do add bills. Nah, they probably add coins. They add them all. I have no idea, dude. Dude, I would get rid of the $1 bill and just have like $1 coins. Nah. Fuck the $1 bill. That'd be $1 fucked $1 up coins. in the fucking, to, in the strip club, people would be getting hurt. Yeah, right? You Wait, toss a coin out of the ball. You make it rain. You make it a hail. People are catching charges. Making it a hail. And then... You like that? That's good. And then, uh... 
<laughs> I don't know. Like what? I hate coins because I can't put them in my wallet easy. Yeah. You're and then you're like, now I, you need me to throw away a dollar. I'd just be like, inflation in this country just went up so much just by the fact that the dollar is shit to carry. Yeah, dude, they got to figure something out with with this fucking currency, bro. They got to stop printing all this money. That's why they're trying to put it in the banks. They're trying to. Dude, I would never leave all my money in a bank ever. ever, ever. That's the worst thing you can ever do. I would just say, if I get, dude, if I, like, once I get some, like, some money, boom, buy a house. Get yeah. some money, boom, buy a house. Yeah, buy a Invest shit. in property. Do this. Yeah, do that. Yeah, yeah. Don't ever hold your money in a bank. It's the worst thing you can ever do. Even just cash, like, if it's in the corner of your house or wherever, it's a bad idea. Yeah. You want to buy if, shit and you If you want, I mean, money. listen, I do suggest burying your money somewhere in the middle of the desert or something. Really? And just knowing exactly where you buried it. Why don't I just have a house in the middle of the desert? No, because it's like a house. Then it's like a house. Like, you can just go to the middle of the desert and if you know where you buried it, like, no one's going to find it. But if it's a house, chances are. Like, think no, about no, no, it. No, but like a ranch. I'm talking about like 100,000 acres or some shit. Oh, dude, that's, yeah, that's Good a lot. Good luck! I would like buried next to like some like mile marker or like something. I don't yeah. know, like some like something I know, you know. Just go yeah, there. And all they have to do is excavate it. All they have to do is. But how make would some they road. know? How would they know? Like nobody. No, no, all they have to do is like you know what? We need to expand this road. Ooh, and <laughs> you're fucked. Ooh, what's going on? Your organs are failing. No, you have to. Are you good on the TP or no? Oh my <laughs> god, you're gonna go mid show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I got TP. Oh. You gotta drop oh, a doozy? Hold on, hold on. Maybe. <laughs> oh my god. I'm sorry. Dude, you're so you crazy. You can talk. You can talk to yourself. Of course. Oh, I can talk to myself. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Yo, if you gotta go, I ain't gonna hold you. Dude, I fucking... Uh, I met a couple people at the bar yesterday when I went to, with that girl. What name did I give her? Rachel. Oh, which that's one? Rachel too. Oh, okay. No, which name? Which one? Just the first one I went. The one I went to the oh, artist oh, yesterday. Oh. The artist. I feel. I don't want to say what I think that I said your name her was because it's the real name of someone else. So oh, okay. Well, I thought it was the A name. Yeah. But okay. I'm no, not no, sure. no. Okay, so with that girl, so I, I was talking with some guys at the bar and dude, crazy shit. So like, so this um, is chick you're currently. Sort of fucking with. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, you know, kind of seeing. So, like, I spoke with these guys, and, dude, it was actually super coincidental. This guy was a huge Bill Burr fan. And, like, he saw my tweet get retweeted by Bill Burr. What? Yeah, because I showed him. I'm like, oh, you're, like, a Bill Burr fan. He goes, yeah, hell yeah. So, I showed him the tweet. He goes, yo, I fucking saw this shit. It was laughing super hard when he retweeted it. What was the tweet that you said? It was the breakup text of all breakup texts. I think I showed it to What him was it? Time. Say it here. I didn't... Sh- I didn't... Do it already? Nah, I don't think so. Are you sure? It doesn't matter. Say it again. This might be someone's first show. We oh, dude. Okay, so if you fucking people want to fucking uh, break up with your girl and you don't have the balls to do it, then break up with your girl. I remember you told me, but I don't know if we said it on the show. Okay. Uh, oh, by the way, um, this is what I tweeted fucking uh, Matt Flavor. You know what that is. J- yeah, 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 hell yeah, hell yeah. Uncle Joe, no, if, he, if, he, if he hits you up, he's coming on the show. Dog, we're bringing that, the show, dude. With I'm us. gonna keep tweeting him until he comes here. Are you yeah. kidding me? That guy's one of the fucking funniest. Guys All right, ever. you hit Uncle Joey. I'll hit the Uncle Uncle Joey, which uh, is Uncle Joe Rogan. And you just hit both of them. Fucking Uncle Joey, Coco Diaz. Joey, Coco Diaz. <laughs> okay, so this is the breakup text of a breakup text. Okay, so hi, this is blank. I'm blank's friend. He doesn't want you to feel bad, but he doesn't want you to take things further with you. He doesn't think you two are compatible. Don't get me wrong. When he first told me about you, he was really excited. But recently, he has felt that things will not work out between the two of you, and he's too scared to tell you. I hope you are not too sad about this. I hear you are hot, so you probably have good prospects. Anyways, I took his phone and he wants it back. Boom. (laughs) And that's my pop from Jersey. That's your dog? Yeah, because she had like... Surgery show, to re- show, show she she had surgery to remove all That's such a cute dog. That she had surgery, fake. dude. She she had surgery to remove all of her teeth, so now her tongue just always. Oh hangs out. Oh my god, she's so cute, dude. dude she's the cute. So her tongue just flops out. Always hangs out. And this is her dad. He's just always chilling in the. Summer. Oh my god, that's her. Him. Oh this shit. This is two different pups. This is his daughter. They both don't have teeth. No, he has to, but his tongue is like kind of big, so it's so like, he just sticks it out. <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> Yo, he's even funnier, bro. He's mad. Fun. If I show you more pictures of him, dude, you're, you're gonna fuck up the show if you do. Let I, me I see. I, show dude, me if later. you want, okay, yeah. If you want, you can look it up. Yorkies underscore of underscore IG. And that's you. That's me, my pit bull, and my four Yorkies. You can look, you can look. It's like mad pictures. You can look it up. Yorkies. Y O R K I E S. Mm hmm. Underscore of underscore IG. Perfect. I'm in it. You're in it. I'm in it. People, get on that if you want to see Tully. Dude, you're almost 2,900 likes. You should see his pets. He is a petophile. Dude, I I'm want a up. fish tank ASAP. I want like exotic. Are you a thing. pedophile? A pet? I love pets, dude. I love if pets. I, dude. dude, honestly, like if I can have like, what's your favorite of all time? Sure. I love dogs, but wolves are probably my favorite ever. Would you have a wolf? Oh, I would love God. a wolf. Yes, dude. I would love three wolves, dude. And I'll you, be part you of can't that. have one wolf. It just doesn't work. It's you hard. Have to have it, two. It's hard to have two. You gotta have at the very least three. Really? Yeah. So my idea of three was good. Yeah. So me and the three, we can run yeah. together. Yeah. Naked in the forest. Two's a couple. Three company. Is a pack. Three's a pack. Two is just good. What about four? I'm the four. Four's good, yeah. I'm four's the alpha. Good, yeah. I'll be punching these niggas right in the face. Yo, right in the face, dude. No, I you gotta, like, show them your teeth, too. And they're like, <sighs> you gotta, like, take their meat and, like, <sighs> it's mine. Really? Seriously? Yo, because a wolf can. Bro, have you seen how big a wolf is? It's not like a normal dog. No, I know. Huge. It will fuck you up. They will fuck your fucking everything. Wait, up. so you have to keep doing it as an adult? Well, you gotta you take bites out of raw meat. Yeah, dude, you gotta like, uh, yeah, you gotta show him that it's yours. It's not his first. It's yours. If you want his food, you can take his food whenever you want. That's being alpha. I know. Because once no, he I get it. Once he senses that he you're did. like a weakness in you. He's turning. He's gonna fucking. He could potentially turn on you. Hundred percent. Espe especially a male wolf. Yeah. Female wolves are little bitches. They're not gonna do anything. Yeah, but a male wolf. A male wolf will fuck you. Remember up. what uh, I think Joe Rogan was talking about his friend, but um, his friend used to work at a place where they like trained wolf, uh, hyenas. Then one know. time, when the trainers came back and like they had hurt their ankle mm -hmm. and was limping, and so she came in with the limp. And as soon as the hyena sensed a limp, bit her shin, bit her calf off. No way. She bit that shit off. Bit the shit off. Because it sensed the weakness. Yeah. Dude, no joke. Yo, hyena. Fuck hyenas. Those motherfuckers. Dude, I crazy. would fuck one of them fucks up for they fucked and touched me. But goddamn, that's real. You can't, bro. You, you, you can't fight a hyena. That thing will absolutely Dude, a wolf murder. is way more crazy than a hyena. Dude, um, I hyena got the stronger hyena, bite, but hyena. a wolf is more agile. Wolf will fuck you. A wolf up. is more agile. A hyena will absolutely fuck you up. Dude, I'm telling you this, hyena is not as quick. Its hind legs are too weak yeah. for its body, so it gets tired and quick. A wolf, that motherfucker, that motherfucker will, will murk you. Yeah, Dude, the you hyena will have to bite you and hold you down, and like it needs others a lot of times yeah. to help it. Because it might just eat that one bite. And Do you know what I was thinking? I was like, dude, that wolf if you want to go into the like, if you want to go into the fucking forest or jungle and be the king of the jungle, all you really need is like things on your hands or like gloves, which give off el like electricity. So like, if some animal just comes near you, you'd be like, <laughs> and just like shock that shit out of them. Oh, 100%. you know what I mean? So you're saying superpowers? No, just like a, some kind of like a fucking Iron Man little thing on your hands where you can just go and just shock them. You know how hard is that to do? You probably just need like a battery. Connect the battery to your fucking gloves. Just, you know, if some fucking animal fucks with you, you can just... 40,000 volts right in their fucking Yeah, I face. think that's what, like, a cattle prod is. <laughs> Dude. No wolf would ever fuck with me. No. Kidding me? They definitely wouldn't. What's your, um... What do you have planned this evening? Are you going to be watching playoff basketball? Mm. That's you. I have to go, uh, probably meet up with Matthew for a little bit. I don't know if he's got a tutor. With the but if he doesn't, yeah, um, probably just gonna go watch the game, man. What, what I love fucking basketball. Me too. Man. What does he? Probably. What does he tutor? Mm. Math. He's, he's got his. Good? He's got his master's in in biochemical engineering. He's super smart. The man is pretty smart. He's he's pretty weird though. Pretty interesting guy. Oh, I told, I told, oh. can I show you something? Sure. Real quick. Okay. Sure, sure. I told him to get on the show. He said he'd be down a little bit. So but this is Matt just be the from weirdest, like, the weirdest bro. Dude. This is Matt from yesterday.
<laughs> he's just popping the bullets out? Yeah. Why? Uh, I, <laughs> I just, I taped this. That's him. Yo, put it up to the camera so they can see it. This, this, our homie is taking, what is that, AR-10? Wait, how? He's just ejecting the Oh my the god, dude, out. this song, I thought this song was a part of the thing. It, but it's not, that's so funny. Wait, is it? What's going on? Are you sure? What the fuck oh, is happening, what? dude? What are you doing, bro? The, the iPhone, like you said, like you started off with, is as good as the iPhone 1. What is it, the 6? Is that the 6S? It. There's the 6S Plus. Holy shit, it's a piece of shit. Oh, yeah, listen. The sound. I wanted you to hear the sound. He sound. just ratcheting the bullets out. Yeah. Why? Just for it the takes camera? Forever, it just takes forever to reload. I know. Yeah, it's a sick dude, he but, is dude, a sick Dude, follow 35 followers. What do, you think, what do you think about him? Well, where is that from? Damn. Ah, uh, you know you're at a real Mexican joint. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, how many pictures did you take? Was that all yesterday? I just put them all up yesterday. 13 pictures. Were those new pictures take you took no, yesterday? No, no, no. No, not at all. This is me in Denver. This is this, this, These are all my goodies in Denver. When'd you go to Denver? For two days when I drove from New Jersey to here last night. Bruh, I'm Dude, going to Denver I got it. In, uh, this month. Dog. I got to Denver. First of all, it was May and it was snowing. Yeah. I was shocked. I was stuck there for two days. I go <laughs> to the store. I'm like, all right, I want some powerful shit. I need some bud. I need some fucking bubble hash. Mm. I need four swishers. Mm. And I need some THC peach tarts. And they sold you all that. Sold me all that shit, right? Holy the peach shit. Tarts. The swishers, too. Dude, the peach tarts, though. Dude, I got so stoned from the peach tarts. I literally woke up in the middle of the night. And I tried to go to the bathroom. Like, I tried to walk to the bathroom. I couldn't, like, really walk straight. I was, like, all stumbling and shit. No way. I ate every single peach tart that night. Holy shit. No, I'm sorry. I'm I'm lying. Not every single one. There was, like, ten peach tarts in there. I ate, like, a good, like, six. They were, like, infused with that that is ten nice. milligrams per peach tart. So I had, like, 60 milligrams. Bro, I, smoked like, yeah. I just bubble hash. I was doming in my room just... You know, how Joey, you know how Joey Coco just throws in 200? Dude, Joey Coco with the stars? He's huge, dude. I'm not looking at great. 200 milligrams, He's dude. Crazy. Too hot, bro. Yo, would you, get, would you smoke with him? Hell yeah. That fool would smoke us on Uncle the table. Joey? I think the old me could stick with him, but now... Oh, no. Coco Diaz? Nah, there's nobody catching up to Coco Diaz. That motherfucker's crazy. Nah, I'll roll with him. If I, get every, if I get eight hours of sleep, I can roll with him for a day. That's a bet. Open a book in Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. April 26th. Okay. So. Wait, it's almost wait, May, you? dog. Yeah, I know. Oh May, I'm God. going to the end of May. Denver, doggy. Mm. I'm going to be out there shooting fucking free throws with uh, uh, Draymond Green. No way. I don't know where I came up with that. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, actually, I, was, I actually met DeAndre Jordan. Nothing but air. <laughs> you see that nigga? You see that row. nigga with the terrible free throws? Yo, that means Yo, you're just psychologically like, weak, right? Um, if you do, nah, like, the first one means he missed it, and the second one means he's psychologically weak. He's just psychologically weak. Because, like, listen, the first one, you're like, just wow. br- brush it off, buddy. Or, or it means he's psychologically super strong, and he's like, no, that, that felt right just in going, let me just do the same thing. And he did exactly the same thing in a very I don't get it, dude. I don't get how, like, these fucking people play basketball their entire lives. Can't shoot a free throw. Don't you see the mechanics? They never start with the legs. That's the number one thing. This I can understand not, with Shaq. My secret, bit. yo, what helped me a lot was like, I used to always shoot like this. Yeah. My free throws, and then like, I started, shoot, I started shooting like this. This halfway to yeah, this. Yeah, it's better. And that helped, dude, that helped me a lot. Man. And then bending your knees. Yeah. The way. A little tr- trajectory. That's the main thing that most people fuck up on is they don't bend their knees. That's why a lot of people have those rituals so they remember to bend their knees mostly. It's like this. You get up. You set your feet how you want. Uh, and then shoot. You know, get yeah. down into your shot. Do you shot. remember Richard Hamilton's... Uh, he had a, like a little routine. He goes this. Two to the dun, right. Dun, flip dun, it dun, around. Yeah. And then shoot. You know, the main reason he did that was so he could bend his knees. Yeah. Jason Kidd too, he had that one when he... To, to his family. Yeah, and he's like holding but the ball. But then it's funny they found out he was cheating he's like, on his wife the whole time. And beating his wife. And, and beating his wife. <laughs> and he stopped doing 
<laughs> yeah, he did stop he doing it. He stopped doing it after it. That's low key sort of. Yo, he's yo. Honestly, I'm a big kid hater. Let me tell you why. So, it was me and my friend after a Nets game. Um, it was Nets versus Knicks at the Nets Stadium in Jersey. It was called Meadowlands yeah. Arena at that point. I remember Meadowlands. Uh, Continental Airlines Arena, actually. Yeah, that yeah. Meadowlands was the whole complex, yeah, and yeah. that was Continental Airlines Arena. Right. And this fucking guy, everybody's coming down, like, everyone signs autographs. Nate Robinson was cool, came out, signed autographs and shit. Nice. Fucking guy, dude. First of all, Zach Randolph comes out, doesn't even say how to anybody, just hops in his car. and just Zach Randolph? Because he was on the Knicks. Oh, he was? He, I forgot. Do you remember it was him, Nate Robinson, Jamal Crawford? Oh, oh yeah. When Isaiah was coach. Zebo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zebo. That's right. This fucking guy, Jason Kidd, you know? There's so many kids waiting for him, bro. All you just see is just him driving his Aston Martin with a hot-ass chick. He doesn't even stop for any of the fans. It's like, bro, not even a lot of us, like 10 kids that are waiting for you, dude. It's, yeah. not, it's not like you had like 40, 50 fucking people waiting for your autograph. It was like 10 kids. The guy just drives past him and everyone's like, really hey, Jason, 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 Jason. He's like, hey. He just like drives off. Doesn't even open up his window. I mean, they got to do it everywhere, though. Every now You're and then. You're at home in New Jersey. There's 10 people waiting for your autograph. All of them kids. You stop your fucking car, you scumbag. I know. I guys. agree. But every now and then, you got to understand from their point of view, listen, maybe it's not 95% of the time, you just saw them with the 5% they didn't. Like, what are you going to say? No, Jason Kidd is definitely a scumbag. He's definitely a scumbag. <laughs> definitely. Just so on that one? Yeah. Oh, and beating his wife a little Beat bit. his wife and shit. Fuck that guy. I mean, that type of shit. And then, happen. um, dude, I met so many nice celebrities. Like, I met so many people that are way more important, way more, have more celebrity status than him that were like a million times nicer. Yeah. Like, I can tell you this. I want to, I got an autograph from Pete Sampers. Twice. At the same time, and he was cool about it. He gave you two. But he's not that. He was not. And his pinnacle in the year 2000, when I met him in Miami, he was the number one tennis player. Pete Sampers, in year 2000, yeah, okay. he was like one of the top players in the world. Ever. Yeah, ever. Where he's got 16, no, 14 majors. Yeah. Like four, yeah, but, 14 majors. but Sampras was never even that as popular as Agassi out here. As a, as a, oh. You know a, what I'm saying? As a celebrity. Ag- Agassi? Yeah. Yeah. Just as a celebrity. Yeah, Sampras is Agass- always understated like yeah, Tim Duncan yeah, yeah. style, you know? It, it's because I mean. Agassi was like. He won, I think he he was one of the only athletes to do all four majors at one uh, in one year. Yeah, and like he was the American fucking. Oh, and dude, he wear wigs and shit. To yeah, and shit. he was married to like a Hollywood chick too. Yeah, he it was just like he was in the eye. Brooke Shields. Wait, was he married to Brooke Shields? Was that Sampras? No, that, no, that was, was Andre Agassi. Agassi yeah. Or I don't know, one of those fucking. What about Hollywood women? Isn't it funny how... I mean, Matumbo... Dude, Matumbo was super nice. I met him at a Chinese I restaurant. I you super nice. Matumbo was... one of the nicest celebrities of all time. Yeah. Um, Joel Santana I met, super nice. Jim Jones, the the fucking homie. The nice. Justin Tuck, homie. I met him at the... Yeah, you said... I you met said him at Jimmy's a nice dude? G- Yo, Jimmy was a mad nice dude to me. I played what? ball with him. I, play, I said what's up to him at the gym, bro, because I was like a normal dude. I, I was like, yo... Oh, I didn't act like a fanboy. I was like, yo, I just heard that song, uh, Perfect Day, last night. He came out with, like, with some song called Perfect Day. I was yeah. like, yo, that's a hot song, dude. Yo, it's fucking awesome, dude. He was all, thanks, man. No, no, no. First, he was like, I told, I was like, yo, I heard that, I heard the new song last night. He goes, oh, thanks, man. Like, wait, like, which song are you, are you talking about? And he, like, looks toward his boy. His boy's name was, like, Shooter. Yeah. Shooter. He, like, looks toward his boy. He was all like, yo, like, listen to this. And I'm like, oh, I think it was called. I was like, and I couldn't remember for a second. I was like, oh, it was called Perfect Day. It was like, oh shit, you're nice, man. You're nice. Like, you know, I was like, awesome. Yeah, I, I, I always wonder. I always wonder if Jimmy was cool. I could tell Joel's would be cool. Yo, Jimmy's cool if you don't bother him during his family time and shit. Like, I would never like his wife. That's why the thing is, is, I sat next to his wife at a, a Mexican restaurant in Jersey. It was me, my boy Han, and our other friend. We sat at a place called Rosa Mexicana. That one wife that was sleeping with all the dudes? Chrissy Thomas. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, we sit next to these two black chicks. Chrissy! Yeah, no, no. We, like, randomly, we sit next to these two black chicks. And, like, like, randomly, you know, we just started talking. And she's like, oh, like, yeah, we're doing a, a, a reality TV show. Um, I'm Jim Jones's wife. And I'm like, oh, really? I'm like, no way. Like, I, I lift with Jimmy all the time at the 24-hour fitness. He goes, oh, that's cool. Like... 
And then we asked her for an internship. Like, it was like, so me and like three guys were like, yo, like if you ever need any help, if there's any internships, like, you know, we'll do a good job. You know, we're all local Jersey guys. Yeah. You know, we know you guys live in Jersey too, you know? Yeah. She's like, yeah, she like took our shit down. No shit. Didn't never Thanks emailed us. Yeah, never emailed us. still them. took it though. Still took it. She was still nice enough to take it, even though she probably was never going to do anything. Yeah. She still took it. She was still nice enough to take it. Yeah. So she, she, oh, super nice, you know? like Yeah, I wouldn't even expect She her wasn't to. even like, you know, she didn't think much of herself. She wasn't like a fucking pretty girl. Like, like oh, fuck no, this no, fucking she was, she was no, dude, She was so cool. She yeah. just wanted to talk about her show, like yeah. what she's doing, you know, get no a No disrespect to Jimmy. We love you, Jimmy. I heard, I heard that, you know, she was like, she gets down with a lot of rappers and shit. You know, remember Max B used to say something about that. Yeah. About Chrissy getting down with yeah. uh, a lot of rappers and shit. So, I don't know. I don't know. I don't yeah. know. That's why the... Uh, yeah. Free Max B, though. Yeah. Max B to wave, baby. It's funny. The hotel where the whole incident happened of why he went to jail. Like, I pass by that hotel every day. It's like 10 minutes from my house. Yeah. Bro, do you think that he did have something to do with it? Those fools fucked him up. F- fucked him over and did it without him knowing. I think he knew. I think he probably did. I mean, yo, know, just me knowing that crew, like, bro. No, but why like, would he do that? He was blowing up, dog. I really feel he like he did it, though. Because, like, yo, when you're on, like, that level, like, you sometimes start to think you're, like, God and shit. Yeah, untouchable. Like, yeah, you're untouchable. Like, go get that. Go so, get that cake. Like, they probably owed him cash. But yeah. Go get that cake. Yeah. They're going to go get the cake. Yeah, I'll come for the ride. I'll be the back. I got yeah. nothing to do with this. Yeah. Except the fact that you know about it, you got something to do with yeah. it. Damn. This shit is crazy. For free Max Vito. Does it, 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 Free Shmurda. Free Shmurda. I heard, Free I heard he might get out. I heard Max yeah. might get out. Free Shmurda. Shmurda might never get out. Yo, my homies. Nah, he will. He will. Yeah? He's got too much, uh, he's got too much uh, money-making potential. Nah, they're letting him rot so far. Yeah, I know. For now, because it's a $2 million bond. I think the judge is doing it on purpose, because we know these hip-hop cops in New York. New York is, like, notoriously known for this type of shit. Yeah. Notorious. Yeah. I like... Actually, like like, if you get any sort of name, you can't roll around with shit. You can't roll around with shit. Ja, ja and Lil Wayne got popped yeah, in one day. <laughs> same block. Same block. Yeah, I thought it was the same two of us. It was the same block. Like, within warrant? an hour. Within an you hour. want a warrant for us to search your shit? Ha! It's funny. Fresh <laughs> out. Yeah, yeah, warrant. They said, fuck you, bitch. Get the fuck out of here. We know you. Hell yeah. We, you, you can catch us slipping when we don't get the shit. Yeah, exactly. It's like, ah. Uh, you won't catch 50 Cent slipping, though. That's the one cat. You'll never yeah, catch Yeah, what slipping. does he do? He just has... Bro, he has the crew, dude. He has he just the has, crew. He pays the people who can carry guns to be around him all the time. Bro, because 50 guys. Cent's like a... Dude, Where's he's like a real at? G. Where's his weed at? What? He smokes. 50? Yeah. No, he yes, doesn't. he does. Man, you kidding me? He smokes. I mean, listen. I've heard people ask him this shit all the time. He's like, no. Nah, he just lies. He, he lies seen. about he, it. He could be. I've never nah, seen bro, him smoke. I've seen him so. I haven't seen him... I I, seen him what's the song on that first fucking album? High all the time. I've seen him smoke in some in some videos. Oh, well, maybe music video. I don't, I don't know. Yeah. But all I know is like in all the interviews, I'm high all the asked time him, I smoked that good shit. Yeah, but he's a storyteller. Okay, well, <laughs> way, but yo, I like I totally see Fifty as the type of dude. I think because dude, sometimes. all the bosses probably yeah. they don't do no drugs. They just do their business shit. Yeah, you know what I mean. I don't think he smokes that much. It, to keep sometimes. up the persona of the people that you know, like to keep up that persona, and people love to hear that shit. Yeah, high all the time. I smoke the good shit. No, like, but that was before he was big. And um, dude, so he like uh, I don't know, dude. I don't no, see saying, him as the type of person to blaze. Like I know Tony Yeo fuck blazes all fuck. I think I think Fifty blazes sometimes, bro. Right? But yeah, I don't know. He talks about it sometimes now. He's a little bit more open about it than he used to be ten years ago, five years ago. Just on songs. Yeah. Because for a long time he didn't even rap about that. His shit. new song is good, yo, dude. I like his fucking mixtape. Yeah. The Canaan tape. Canaan tape was hard, right. man. You even watch that show, bro? You say you're a fifty fan. Um, you even watch Power? I'm saving it. I'm saving because I want to binge watch the whole day. Boom, get it over with. It's good. That's not what Fifty wants you to do, brother. I know. It's all right, bro. You're missing out, dog. I saw 50 Ghost, Cent in concert a Ghost, couple times. Bro, anyone who's watching Power should know this. That's my shit. Yeah. As soon as that's back on, all my other fucking shows drop to the side. That's my shit. Power's good. I hear bro, it's like... It's, it's like, fire. It's fire. Yeah. It's third season coming up. Shit is fire. That's yeah. what I'm saying. You he's been working on it hard. I, I, like, I mean, seeing his he's like a creator. Someone else wrote it, right? But he's like double checks 
like yeah. all the dialogue and like all the yeah, dude, weirdness I, to make sure it's like legit. I fucked with Fifty, dude. I that, fucked with that, 50. that dude. And the thing is, yo, he's like he's an OG in New York, dude. Yeah, like, he's got dude. Southside Jamaica Queens, dude. That guy's got hitters. Oh, 100%. Dog, nobody dares to fucking talk shit about him, like, and expect not to see anybody at their door within, like, an hour. In, in New York? Every, uh, New York, Connecticut. That's that interesting, because, like, you know, people out there don't even know that, and I sort of wondered, like, is it is it like that with Jada and shit? Yeah, probably. Cause he did. He's super fucking hood too. He's young. Yeah, he's young all day. all day. He has a fucking. And all I told you, his laundry mat apparently, allegedly, apparently, could be the Some plug shit. spot. Yeah, yeah. The plug spot. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't think it is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it is. I hope. I hope. I, I dude. I keep. I bet you keep his hands clean, bro. He's too small for that. What the fuck? You think a person can't look at millions versus ten ten cents and be like, mm. it's not ten cents, bro. You get, do you know how much how crazy that business is there, dog? How much understand. money you can make doing that? Yeah, but do you understand? The money doesn't matter if you go to a box. I mean, he's got people. It doesn't money. matter if you go to a box. All these fools. How how long are you gonna go to a box for? For the most, like, dude. If you if you just twenty. Gonna, dude, but if you're smart, about you can be it, make dude, If you're smart about it, they don't want to go for anything. They're old enough. Man, I don't think you're looking at it right. You're not close enough to look at it right. You're looking at it from just opportunity. I'm telling you, I was like, no, you're not, I've lived you're there. not judging the risk. I know what you're saying. No, I know. But, but the, the people that you're saying aren't making millions somewhere else. They're not making millions elsewhere. I can tell you this. Okay, so do you know Freg Billionaire? Yeah. Okay, so. Yeah, I, I know he got caught up on crack. He did his time. He got caught up with a QP of crack. I'm not. Bro, no, I stay and understand I'm the rap gonna, game. I'm not going to. Hold on. I'm not, I'm, I'm, no, 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 dude. I can't talk about this. No, you should. No, I, trust me. I can't. But. Dude, Let's say allegedly. I'm going to tell you this, man. They, like, people like Jadakiss, like, they won't, like, bro, but they, they definitely got their fucking. Uh, still, they probably, still got the operation going in the hood. Dude, yeah, but I bet sure. you there's nowhere tied to them. I bet you the way they collect money is even. Oh, iffy. yeah, yo, because, yo. They're smart, dude. They, dude, they got lawyers now. Jada yeah. kids got money and where lawyers tell him, like, pretty much tell him how to do this shit. Yeah, yeah. That's how it works. If you no. got money, you got good lawyers, they'll literally tell you how to get away with this yeah, shit. Yeah, 100%. I understand you that. Know? But what I'm saying is, like, and, f- and they're not going to do it out of their laundromat, necessarily. It might be their laundromat, but I bet you on paper it's like, not that's, their laundromat. Yo, like, that's the, like, that's, like, the word in the street. Like, their laundromat... It's like the plug spot. Like, I don't know how... I've never been there, yeah. but, like, that's what, like... That's what, what the word on the Boy, street was. Yeah. Seriously. I dig it. But, um... Yeah, I gotta tell you that Fred Dillon your story. That's nuts. Seriously. I, the, Why the, can't you say here? Because I can't. It's bad. Yeah. Arrested against someone well, I got. I gotta go to the bathroom. Arrested I'm against stop. someone killed? Yo, will you tell me once you're done with the bathroom? Uh, off the record. Yeah, off the record. Yeah. I'm gonna finish the show right now, bro. Alright, totally sick in the shit. He got some he got some scary stories we can't tell on uh, camera. So there is actually some shit we can't say, ah, I guess. But um thank you, love you. <sighs> Fucking shit, man. Stay out the box, motherfuckers. You know what it is. <laughs>